Welcome to Super Draw, the how to draw tutorials where you can draw super good drawings. In today's episode, we are going to draw a cartoon volcano. This idea just popped into my head randomly today, so I decided to practice it a few times and then do a drawing of it. Anyway, in this episode, you'll need um, a pencil and eraser, a black sharpie marker or any type of black marker like a mr sketch maybe and these colors in pencil crayons or oil pastels or any type of coloring utensils that you can um shade with markers won't work in this case so make a very light line just down here on on the bottom half it will be the actual volcano guy on the top half it will be the eruption and most of the eruption won't even be there. We won't even color it. I mean, draw it. But then we'll just use the colors. And then we'll just, yeah, you'll see. So right here, we'll do this very long straight line. <coughs> then we'll go up. Right, just to the top of that line. And do the same right here. Then we'll connect with like a smile. Then... This is the basic shape of our volcano man here. So then we'll do two diagonal lines. This is a very hard part because you need these to look exactly the same. They're half about. So you don't want to start very at the edge, but just before. You'll do two circles. Well, the half circles. Then you'll do a tiny U right there. You'll color it in. And then you have his eyes. I'm just going to make this a little bit longer on both ends. His nose is just a like pointy, sharp nose. And then we'll do a wavy line, another wavy line, and these very small wavy lines to connect it. Then for his teeth, we'll just do straight lines, probably about ten of them. Maybe five, actually. Down like that, and then we'll put one big line in the middle. Now it looks like he's very angry. His feet are just four lines. Two of them are close together, and then there's a big gap, and then the other two. Then here we'll have to do his shoes. So they go up like that, and come right back in. And we'll do two lines for his shoelace, and then, you know the interior of a light bulb? When you draw that, it, you kind of go up, then you make a half circle and go across. And then you go, and then you do um, another kind of like backwards P. And then we'll do the exact same on the other side. Alright, there's his shoes. Oh yeah, just, to, and then right here, we'll have like the end of his legs and then his shoes for his arms so i have been really trying to find figure out what position his arms are going to be in and i decided they'll be up and they'll be really angry so these will be go slightly above the halfway line then we'll do five um you know that shape it's hard so hard to explain and do a, a line and then a type of C connecting them all for his fingernails. So then we'll do the exact same on the other side. All right, this guy looks hilarious. And so pretend that there's a big line, and right about here, there's a bunch of smoke, which is just a bunch of upside-down U's going around like that. At the end, this will, it will be kind of, and then we'll just very lightly have like a gray color. And we just use this by doing our pencil very lightly. <coughs> so if you're not, um, <coughs> if you're using like a different type of, like a Sharpie marker, and doing it immediately, it's okay. You can just get a great um, 
pencil crayon or oil pastel and color it in how I'm doing it. All right. To make him look all rocky, we'll just do random lines. All over him. You can choose where to do the lines. You don't have to do them the exact same of how I'm doing them. All right, time to Sharpie. Just, you have to make... Now his eyes are going to look very well when you do the sharpening. See, so if you don't want to color it and just sharpie it, then this will be about the time when you can stop the video. Because after I'm done doing this very boring sharpening, um, it will be time for coloring. And believe me, coloring is very interesting because in some of them I don't shade and I use markers instead but this time I'm shading because they'll have like um, some different shades of brown Another art channel like this that I would love to recommend for anyone that enjoys these is Art for Kids Hub. They even have their own website. And it's a guy named Rob, and he has three kids, and they all do drawings with him. So he'll do a drawing, and then they'll do a drawing. But you're supposed to follow his drawings. And it's very good, and, even, and it works much better than this one. So... If you enjoyed this and want to do even more advanced projects, check out Art for Kids Hub. Alright, <coughs> it's time to start coloring! So the here, we'll use our red and do a very light shade. Actually, that's orange. Oh, well, it's kind of reddish, orangish. Go we'll and just do stuff right there. So then we'll go over it with yellow. I'm doing this very light and then true orange here. That is his eruption. <laughs> his fingernails are actually a really odd color. It's just um, light brown. And his shoes are also light brown too. It's kind of golden. Really, it kind of looks orangish. I have the worst time of colors. I'm I'm slightly colorblind, so I have the worst time telling about colors. So if you find I'm coloring this totally wrong, then please correct it. Alright, here's our brown. This will not take very long at all to color. Oh, right, and this guy um, <clears throat> has red eyes. So all the parts around that little black that you can and on his eyes are just going to be red. They just make him look more mad. I have to say, this might be one of the funniest, um, Super draws I've ever done. Like, I know that Slimer is hard to beat, but this one is very just funny. Oh, yeah, and <clears throat> don't sharpie the explosion part, that part, because it, it doesn't, it doesn't have, like, a border to it. And another part of that of the coloring that I nearly forgot is all of his teeth except 
that one right there will color in very lightly so it looks like he has um, gray teeth and then what we'll, and then he'll have that one that isn't colored is we're coloring in yellow so he has a golden oh, golden brook um, tooth all right this is probably really weird all right <coughs> I'm always really pressed for time on these videos, so guys, try to remember to take your time when you're doing um, the coloring, because I leave a lot of white spaces. Oh, one minute, I just have to sharpen um, my pencil crayon. Alright, back. Alright guys, we're almost done the video. So if you really enjoyed this video and want some of your favorite um, characters or just drawings that you like in particular doing, man, he looks awesome. Um, please leave a comment on this video telling me what you want me to do next. Bye!